the ingredients, when you look at, at, at what Optimus is, what's required to make Optimus and the various ingredients, uh, what do you need to do to make, to do high volume uh, humanoid robot production? Uh, I think it's worth considering that really the cars we make are already robots, but they're four-wheeled robots. So Tesla is already the biggest robot manufacturer in the world because every car we make is a robot. Um, and when you break it down to the fundamental elements, you've got, you've got batteries, power electronics, uh, motors, uh, gearboxes, you've got uh, you know, connectivity, uh, you've got a, a vision-based AI, Hi, Optimus. <laughs> um, and um, you know, all the various pieces that you need for a humanoid robot, you need the AI chip, you need the AI software, you need to be able to manage a large fleet. And, um, and so really, Optimus is a robot with arms and legs as opposed to, as opposed to a robot with wheels. So. You know, Tesla's ideally suited, I think, to, to make, to succeed in this arena. Um, it, it, you, you, you will see certainly many uh, companies showing demonstration robots. There's really three things that are super difficult about robots. One is the engineering of the forearm and hand, uh, because the human hand is an, an incredible, incredible thing, actually. It's super dexterous. So uh, engineering the hand really well, the uh, real world AI, and then volume manufacturing. Those are generally the things that are missing, one or more of those things are missing from other companies. Um, so Tesla is the only one that has all three of those. Uh, yeah, so, yeah. <laughs> So this is the Optimus kind of uh, initial, it's a, kind of the prototype production line. The, the high volume production line will be very automated, obviously, but this is, this is really the production line that we use to make the prototypes. So you can get a sort of rough sense for what it takes to build the robot. Um, and then, as I've said before, I think w once we reach uh, about a million units per year uh, of sustained production or in excess of that, I think probably the cost of production uh, is around twenty thousand dollars in current year current year dollars. So this will be certainly very affordable, um, and uh, yeah, like I said, I think Optimus will ultimately increase the size of the economy probably by a factor of ten or more. Um, you know, next year we start production with Optimus version three. Uh, this, what you're seeing here is Optimus version 2.5. Optimus three is is an incredibly good good design. The Tesla engineering team is amazing. Um, when you see Optimus three, yeah. Uh, you it, it will seem as though that there's someone like a, like a person in a robot outfit, um, which is how we started with Optimus. Um, it really is gonna be something special. Um, and then Optimus, uh, Optimus 4, you know, that, that ho hopefully starts production in 27, and then Optimus 5 in 28, so it's kind of like an annual release cycle with significant improvements uh, with each one and, and gigantic increases in the scale of production. So, yeah, Sus sustainable abundance via AI and robotics. That's the future we're headed for. But if you say it down the road, uh, would you be able to say with the neural link, have a snapshot of, or at least an approximate snapshot of somebody's mind and then upload that approximate snapshot to uh, an Optimus body, I think, I think that at some point that technology becomes possible. Um, and it, 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 it's probably less than 20 years. Yeah. But of course, you won't quite be the same, you know. Be a little different. Um, 
because you'll be in a robot body, and uh, <laughs> the, 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 the mental snapshot will not be precise. It'll be a, probably pretty close, but not, not exactly the same. On the other hand, you know, are you the same person that you were five years ago? Nope. I mean, a lot of things have changed. Uh, so, uh, yeah, but I guess at some point, if you want to be uploaded to a robot body, my guess is that becomes possible. Für mehr Videos einfach abonnieren.